This is the Al Shaheen field, 70 kilometers off the coast of Qatar. The field recently celebrated its billionth barrel and it's already responsible for more than a third of the country's oil output. This is an outstanding achievement considering that when the field was discovered back in the 1970s, most experts thought it posed just too many problems to be commercially viable. Its thin reservoir layers, tight rocks and complex flow system meant that oil was difficult to reach and to channel into production wells. I think a Shane project is a unique project because if you look to the history of a Shane project from 1992, when the plan was to produce 30,000 barrels a day. And after 18 years, we are, we are now celebrating production of more than 300,000 barrels. When coming to Qatar in the early 90s, Maersk Oil brought vast experience in dealing with difficult fields from the North Sea and an unrivaled expertise in horizontal drilling. Horizontal drilling technology has enabled the commercial success of the Al Shaheen field. For unlike vertical wells, these provide access to the thin layers of oil held within its reservoirs. The evolution of the Al Shaheen field is ongoing under a long-term development plan. Its latest phase, FDP 2005, includes 15 new platforms 169 wells and 230 kilometers of pipeline. Alongside all that, two of the world's largest super tankers have been converted into FSOs, floating storage and offloading units, to facilitate production. But this whole vast array of sophisticated equipment was put together on time and on budget, much of it by local contractors. The next challenge was to get it all safely in place. That was a huge task, and at peak as many as 25 major operations were taking place simultaneously, involving more than 50 vessels. Remarkably, the installation campaign was being completed on time, on budget, and with an uptime rate of 99%. All activities have been carried out safely, with no major accidents, and flaring has been reduced to an absolute minimum. Al Shaheen has already made a significant contribution to the development of Qatar. That contribution is measured not only by oil revenues boosting the national economy, but in the opportunities it has opened up for Qataris in education, training and employment. Maersk Oil is now working closely with Qatar Petroleum to identify the most effective, sustainable technologies to extend production further from this field, and so it seems that the story of Al Shaheen has only just begun.